conmocionaron a todos. No sé leer, disculpadme. Aún no han comentado el incidente en las autoridades portuarias y se desconoce si había tripulantes a bordo de este en este momento. Los testigos afirmaron ver una fuga de, eh, de salitre al río, pero como la zona está restringida a trabajadores y al público, es posible que pase algún tiempo antes de que tengamos un informe completo de lo ocurrido. Let me know if there's any way I can make it up to you. Tell you what, tomorrow's edition of The Strand is on me. Well, that was an utter waste of time. An assassination did seem rather unlikely. There was supposed to be another burglary, I was certain of it. Hmm. Something you wish to say, Doctor? No? Well... Only that you have a remarkable faculty for deduction and pattern recognition. And that perhaps, if ill applied, I see things that are not there. Yes. It is London. There will always be burglaries. Doesn't have to mean anything. So it seems. Forgive me. Without something to occupy my mind, I turn into an entirely different animal. Which brings us back to my news from earlier. I think I have a case for you, a real one. Truly? Indeed. Though perhaps not as thrilling as your stories from Cordona, a patient of mine, Captain Stenwick, told me that his servant disappeared. I said I knew just the man to help. What do you say? Oh, Watson. Yes, I know it's not the most tantalizing mystery, nor the story to launch my writing career, but it's brilliant. Let's go. Oh, good. Well, his house is nearby. Come. Tiene una mansión grande cerca, está ubicada en la misma calle de la librería. Daré por hecho que es esta. Good day, gentlemen. Forgive the intrusion. Captain Stenwick, this is my colleague Sherlock Holmes, the consulting detective I told you about. At last, a professional. This useless officer refuses to do anything about Kimi here, my missing servant. What was your name again? I shall be certain to inform your superiors. Sergeant Ruffles. It is my superiors who made this decision, sir. Have there been other disappearances lately? Of course, here and there. When life is tough and opportunity comes knocking, you can't blame those who answer. Why has the police department decided not to help? We investigate murders, thefts, fraud, arson, real crimes. A servant walking away from his master is not our highest priority. That said, if we find Kimahia breaking the law, we'll be sure to notify Captain Stenwick. Now, I must be off. Best of luck in your search. <laughs> you heard that, didn't you? The way that man spoke to me. I shall need your written testimony. Then we can lodge a complaint. Captain, perhaps Mr. Holmes' time is better spent learning about your servant, so that he may begin his investigation. Ah, yes. Quite right. Fire away. Tell me about him here. He's foreign. A Maori. All the way from New Zealand. Biggest man you've ever seen. And as strong as two. Dark hair and fearsome tattoos. He doesn't speak a whit of English, never bothered to learn. But I made do with pointing. I invested a lot of money in him, so he must be found. When did you last see your servant? Kimmy here normally brings me the morning papers, but yesterday I had to get them myself. He must have escaped the night before yesterday. May I see your servant's bedroom? His shack is in the garden. You can't miss it. Did you search the room? Of course. But only to check he wasn't lying dead inside. Everything seemed normal at a glance. Is there any reason Kimahir may have left? I should think not. He had all he could have wanted. 
gainful employment, new clothes, and all the cabbage he could eat. Did Kimmer here make off with anything of value? Heavens no. I would have mentioned it to Sergeant Ruffles. Still, he must have fled with some money on his person. No, no. I kept his wages in my safe. For security. I take it this is the first time Kimmer here has vanished? Undoubtedly. The man seemed terrified of the city. I think it was all the noise. He never left this estate. Should he cause any damage, I will bear the responsibility. For it was I who rescued him from savagery and brought him here to England in the first place. All right, Captain. I think I have enough to get started. We shall first take a look around the mansion. Go ahead. I'll be here, mentally drafting my complaint. Okay. Chewing tobacco. like a knee print. A shoe print, roughly size 11, with a worn-out sole. These are a workman's boots. Someone knelt here. The amount of chewing tobacco suggests they were waiting a while. Amazing, Mr. Holmes, to read the ground like an open book. Vale, ahí se escondió This lock is quite unusual It appears that the key should be bent to the right ¿Qué tal? Ok Vale, aquí es donde vivía el tío Impressive The second grain retained the shape of an impact eso, eso te iba a decir yo Una cabeza muy concreta, ¿no? Como muy tocha, ¿no? A small navy spyglass. Okay. Estuvo en la marina. No air coming through it. 
Que hay un hueso eh, Esto es como una patata Vale, el tío se colocó aquí a muerte O sea, pero, pero literal Que va <ríe> Va colocadillo de más, eh No, no te preocupes Vale Ahí tienes Una de las cosas Por lo que seguramente El tío dijo No mi cielo No mi ciela Porque literalmente es un trapo O sea, eh Esto es como... Como aire Vale, un aire acondicionado un, O sea, tú, un, tú tienes Una chimenea El humo se tiene que ir A algún sitio ¿No? El humo se tiene que ir No se puede quedar dentro Pues si tú tapas el humo se queda adentro eh, Se ha colocado a muerte eh. Todavía no lo sabemos Pero muy posiblemente lo que haya pasado Es que, que al tío O, o la haya diño y se lo, han, y se lo hayan llevado O Sí, tiene... Vale, y, y entonces cayó aquí Haciendo puff Y una vez que hizo puff Se tuvo que mover Lo movieron en... En este carro Makes his servant live in a tool shed. You think you know someone? Este carro no me cuadra. O sea, aquí se preparó algo. De de aquí se movió para allá. Luego le, le intentaron dar una paliza Bastante bestia, por cierto No o sea, No, 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 sí, 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 sí O sea, solo, solo que este está roto Vale Vamos a ver si encontramos algo para aquí A ver Eh Por 
aquí no puedo mirar nada. ¿Me puedes, por favor? No. Perdón. Do you happen to know Kimihir's shoe size? I wouldn't have the foggiest, but I'm sure it was enormous. Not that it matters. He spent his life barefoot. Despite my best efforts, he simply did not take to shoes. Vale, siempre iba descalzo. Kimihir ever indulged in tobacco? No, the man doesn't even drink. Are you certain? I found chewing tobacco in the garden. I controlled Kimihir's expenses since he struggled with the currency. I would have known if he used tobacco. Are you joking? Why would I know this? Is this spyglass familiar? I don't recognize it. Could it be Kimihir's, perhaps? I doubt it. I never saw him with it. Nor could I suggest how he might have come by it. I thought you were meant to be intelligent. The door to your garden has an interesting lock. Yes, I have uncommon locks on every door of my mansion. It makes them harder to pick. Kimi here and I both had a set of keys. I'll need to borrow them. No, you'll need to do what I tell you to do. Examine the garden. Tres pistas actualizadas. Claro, el tío se lo tuvieron que llevar por la puerta por cojones. This lock is quite unusual. It appears that the key should be bent to the right. No cuadra, pero si cuadra que se lo pudieran haber llevado por ahí. Claro, aquí me, pas me falta una persona por conocer. El que tiene que estar aquí, desde luego, es un puto extraño. Puede ser. No. Alguien desde aquí mirándole O mirando esta zona Para taponar Esta entrada de, de aire Cuando se cuenta de, de cuando entra Y entonces aquí le atacaron Eh Uh... 
está. Torcida hacia la derecha en los ganchos de la derecha ola, eh. pero hay uno vacío que tiene marcas debajo que tiene... Eh, la puerta... Hay una marca de para la reciente... La... Es un extraño el que, el que lo hace. This lock is quite unusual. It appears that the key should be bent to the right. Es un extraño el que lo hace. Los leños cerca de la chabola están hechos un desastre, como si alguien los hubiese eh, tirado. Alguien movió un carro a este lugar y luego lo tomó en otro lugar. No puedo verlo en el jardín. Hay una marca parecida cerca de la chabola de Kim. Una carretilla de jardín se solía mantener eh, resguardada de la lluvia. Gente, tú, este no me... Vale, entonces... Esta... Y la última... Vale, me, fal me falta... Me falta... Me falta algo. Faltan dos Entonces, en efecto Un desconocido Os observaba Como eh, pues como trabajaba y como hacía sus cosas Clothes made of hessian Is Stemmy really so miser? Eso sí que me cuadra. Y entonces... 
Entonces, aquí... Exacto. Surveilling from afar, the intruder waited for a window of opportunity. When Kimihir went to sleep, the man crept up to the shack and slipped narcotics down the chimney pipe, then blocked it with a cloth. Kimihir inhaled the sedative and fell into a deep sleep. The intruder tried to move him, but the man was heavier than expected. The intruder fell on the sack and dropped his spyglass. In order to transport the servant, he had to use the cart. The final challenge was opening the garden door. Luckily for our intruder, Kimahir had the key in his shack. Remarkable. It makes total sense. Best have found something by now, gentlemen. I found the residue of narcotics in Kimihir's brazier. There are several explanations, perhaps your servant's recreational interest, or an attempt at poisoning. Cut to the chase, Mr. Holmes. I fear that someone may have spied upon Kimihir. I be the owner of the spyglass I found earlier. It appears they were watching for some time. As there was an impressive amount of chewing tobacco on the ground. And your point? You said that you checked the shack earlier. Did you notice the cart tracks near it? Now, one ought to expect a servant to make regular use of such a thing. Indeed, I would have overlooked the detail were it not for the cart's absence. If, as you say, Kimahir never leaves your estate, then where did it go? I expect answers from you, Mr. Holmes, not questions. I won't keep you in suspense any longer, Captain. Kimahir was abducted by the owner of the spyglass. When your servant fell asleep, he slipped a narcotic into Kimahir's brazier to make him sleep even more soundly. In order to carry a man as large as Kimahir, the intruder stole the cart and rolled him right out of your garden. Now, hold on. All this simply to tell me what I already know. Why haven't you found him yet? I only arrived a moment ago. It is, frankly, Incredible that I have already deduced so much. Every second you dawdle here, waiting for me to stroke your ego, is another second wasted. I'm not interested in the how, the why, or the who. I am only interested in recovering my investment. Spare me the claptrap, boy, and go and fetch my servant. The point is, Captain, we're telling you this for a reason. The intruder fled through the garden door, and we need a key to follow his trail. Well, then you should have led with that. Here you go. I hope you'll return soon with good news. And in the meantime, please teach your companion the art of brevity. Ali! ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo estás? A ver eh, ¿A dónde llevan las pistas? Piki, pi Piki, piki, piki El tío está secuestrado Esto no lo podemos saber, pero vamos a intentarlo. A ver, a ver si. A ver si cuela. Ah, no podemos todavía. 